Louisville Cardinals will face challenging 2019-20 men's basketball schedule. Appearances in the Jimmy V Classic, Big 10 ACC Challenge, and a trio of games against in-state foes highlight the 2019-20 men's basketball non-conference schedule for the University of Louisville men's basketball team, announced by head coach Chris Mack on Thursday. Four of the Cardinals' 11 non-conference opponents participated in the NCAA tournament last season, including national runner-up Texas Tech. Louisville has faced a schedule among the top 16 toughest by the ratings percentage index in 10 of the past 12 seasons, including the nation's fourth toughest last year by the net ratings. The ACC moves to a 20-game league schedule this season, eliminating two games that would have previously been against non-conference opponents. Including the Cardinals' ACC schedule, 15 of the Cardinals' 31 games will be played against teams that participated in postseason competition last season, including a dozen from the 2019 NCAA tournament field. 17 of the Cardinals' games will be played against teams that won at least 17 games last season, including 9 against teams that won 29 or more. Five U of L opponents are ranked among the ESPN way too early top 25, including non-conference foes number 3 Kentucky and number 11 Texas Tech. Louisville is fifth in that early ranking that also includes ACC members number 6 Duke, number 8 North Carolina and number 15 Virginia. Including an exhibition game, nine of the Cardinals' 12 non-conference games will be played at home in the KFC Yum Center, U of L spectacular 22,000-seat home arena. The Cardinals will face their first outside competition in an exhibition game on October 29 in the KFC Yum Center against 2019 NCAA Division II regional finalist Bellarmine, a team coached by former U of L assistant Scott Davenport. While not a non-conference game, the Cardinals open their 2019-20 season on November 5 at Miami, the earliest opening game ever for U of L and the first time they have played a conference opponent to open the season. The game will be televised on the ACC Network, the new 24-7 national platform that will launch on August 22. Fans can go to www.getaccn.com to see if their provider is currently scheduled to carry the ACC Network. If a provider is not listed, fans are encouraged to contact them and request the ACCN. U of L faces Youngstown State on November 10 in the first of four games in the Global Sports Shootout in the KFC Yum Center. The Cardinals will also face NCAA first four participant North Carolina Central on November 17, USC Upstate on November 20 and Akron on November 24 in the Round Robin, four-team event. Amidst the tournament is another home game against Indiana State on November 13. Louisville will play its first of three games against schools in the state of Kentucky when it plays Western Kentucky on Friday, November 29 at Bridgestone Arena in Nashville, Tennessee. The Cardinals open the month of December with a return to the KFC Yum Center to face Michigan in the Big Ten ACC Challenge on December 3rd. Louisville will visit Madison Square Garden in New York, New York, to play national runner-up Texas Tech in the Jimmy V Classic on December 10th. The final three non-conference games include home games against Eastern Kentucky on December 14th and Miami of Ohio on December 18th followed by interstate rival Kentucky and Lexington December 28th in the final game of 2019. The ACC moves to a 20-game conference schedule this season, with dates expected to be finalized in September. In U of L's sixth year in the 15-team league, the Cardinals' home ACC opponents will consist of Clemson, Florida State, Georgia Tech, Miami North Carolina, Pittsburgh, Syracuse Virginia, Virginia Tech, and Wake Forest. U of L's 10 league road games will be at Boston College, Clemson, Duke, Florida State, Georgia Tech, Miami North Carolina State, Notre Dame, Pittsburgh, and Virginia. The ACC men's basketball tournament will be staged at the Greensboro Coliseum in Greensboro, North Carolina, on March 10th to 14th. Last season, Louisville achieved a 20-14 record and participated in its 39th NCAA tournament. Picked in the preseason to finish 11th in the ACC, U of L attained a 10-8 conference record and earned a tie for 6th in the final regular season standings. The Cardinals will return 6 of their top 7 scorers from last year and welcome a top 10 recruiting class. The Cardinals have been ranked among the nation's top teams in multiple early rankings by national outlets, including the following, number 2 by John Rothstein, CBS Sports, number 3 by Jeff Goodman of Stadium, number 4 by Gary Parrish of CBSSports.com, 
number 4 by Jeremy Wu of Sports Illustrated, number 5 by Jeff Borzello at ESPN. Com, number 5 by Seth Davis of The Athletic, number 6 by Rob Douster from NBCSports.com, number 6 by Mike Rutherford at SB Nation, number 6 by Kyle Kensing of Athlon Sports, number 8 by David Kenyon at Bleacher Report, and number 11 by Mike DeCourcy of The Sporting News. Louisville has received an NCAA Public Recognition Award six of the last seven years for ranking among the top 10% in men's basketball in the academic progress rate, which measures academic eligibility, retention and graduation for student-athletes. Louisville is one of just nine Division I schools in the nation, including only two from Power 5 conferences, the other being Stanford, which have earned the APR recognition in at least six of the last seven years. By Kenny Klein University of Louisville Athletics